Okay, this is an 07 Tacoma. We're working on rear axle bearings, and this video is for mechanics. Do not put in the comments, uh, why didn't you show how to do the whole thing? Well, if that's your attitude, this video is not for you. Okay, I assume you know how to get to this point here. Uh, there's the truck. We already got the axle out, but now here's the issue I have. They have a special tool to press the bearing out to, to finish this job. I don't have that tool. I got the parts here. I got to get the truck out of the bay. Uh, so you know how to get to this point. Here's the most inner lock ring. You know, cut it, snap it, slide it out. Turn ring I was able to just vibrate out. And you got the snap ring. Final lock ring, which was kind of a bear to get because it was tight up against. Really hard to work with. Sorry for the video quality here. I'm a mechanic. I don't do videos for a living here. Now, here we're down to this. Easy to pop the seal out of the bearing to expose the bearing. You know, just a pick tool. So, real easy to work with. Once that's out, then we need to destroy the bearing cage, which is pretty easy, actually. This uh, Harbor Freight tool, you know, little die grinder here. You grind the rivets off, pull the cage out. Now, you've got the balls exposed in the bearing. However, they won't fit out. So, see what I did here? I'm going to try and set this down. I hope you can still see here. Maybe I can zoom. Let me try this. Okay. What I did, I took this tool, ground a spot here, and ground a spot up here. So now there's room for a ball to come through, but they're still not lined up. However, you can... Sorry for the bad camera quality. It is attached to the vise right now. So that's why you see all this shaking going on. Keep moving it around. And you want to get pretty close. Then you can get in here with a pick tool. Get it over. Lined up just right. And since we ground those spots out. Let me move my light here a little bit. Okay. We can get it forced out. And once you get one out, the rest get easier and easier because there is more. There we go. It just popped out. My hand was probably in the way. Sorry about that. But it just popped out. It's... Okay. Get them out. So it gets easier and easier. Once again, I'm sorry for the camera shaking like that. I can't help it. It's on the bench. And this is turning real stiff because things are all messed up. Okay. Now that one's lined up. Come on, there we go. That one popped out. See, they get easier and easier as you go. Now, once, once you have all of them out, then, let me zoom back out here. Okay, once you have them all out, then the whole backing plate and everything will just come off and then you can take the inner race off uh, traditionally, just like this, you know, cutting and snapping it. And the rest comes apart pretty easy. But without that special tool, I had trouble at this, at this stage here. But basically just take the bearing apart piece by piece. I hope this helps somebody. Um, whether it has ABS or not, it's all about the same. So, all right. Thanks, guys.